Hey guys, it's Kristen and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is one that I'm really, really excited about. It is going to be me trying on and showing my entire Lululemon collection. If you know me at all, you know that Lululemon is my favorite store in the whole entire world, so I have quite a lot of items to show you guys. And I know I'm going to sound so cliche and like the stereotypical YouTuber right now, but I just wanted to say I'm not trying to brag at all um, showing my collection. I just personally love watching these videos, um, and I love Lululemon, so I just really wanted to make this video for you guys. And another thing I just wanted to say, keep in mind that I've literally had some of these pieces since like the 8th grade. And now I just recently graduated college, so that's like nine years. So it's not like I just went into Lululemon one day, spent thousands of dollars on all these items, and I'm just doing a haul. Like, this is truly like a collection video literally since like middle school. So just wanted to say that. I'm going to be trying on all of these items after I hold them up and show them to you guys. I'll link everything that is still available at Lululemon in the description. But like I said, some of these items are really old, so you can't get them anymore. Or I did get a few of these things on eBay or Poshmark, which is something I recommend if you're looking to get Lululemon for cheaper because a lot of times girls will sell like leggings or shirts or whatever for literally half price. Like my favorite pair of leggings is from Poshmark, Lululemon, and I'm pretty sure it was like $40. So definitely, definitely check out Poshmark or eBay or any of those resale websites if you are wanting to try out some Lululemon pieces but also want to save some money. So without further ado, let's get into my Lululemon collection. The first item, it's kind of a joke item, but I found it in my sock drawer, so I thought it would be really funny to show you guys. I'm pretty sure this headband is the first thing that I ever owned from Lululemon. You can tell it's literally, like, stained from I don't even know what, but when I was in middle school, it was a thing for, like, you to go to the mall with your friends and buy a Lululemon headband, and we'd feel so cool walking around with little reusable shopping bags, even though all we could afford was a, like, $20 headband, but... Yeah, just wanted to show you guys that. I don't really wear headbands just because they look really weird on me, but that's my first item. <laughs> so now moving into the actual clothing, I'm going to show bras, then shirts, and then pants because most of the items I have from Lululemon are bottoms just because I feel like that's something that I'm willing to invest in because especially in high school, I wore leggings a lot, but especially in college, I literally wear leggings almost every single day. So in my mind, I think it's worth the investment because the quality of the pieces literally will last you years and years and years and years. Whereas with sports balls or tops, I feel like you can get similar Lululemon quality products at like Target or TJ Maxx for a fraction of the cost. So while I still have some bras and tops from Lululemon, um, I still buy workout tops from other brands, I guess is what I'm saying. But le leggings, I kind of strictly only buy Lululemon. So the first bra is this Soul Cycle Lululemon collab bra. I actually got this pretty recently, like right at the beginning of quarantine. Soul Cycle was having a huge sale and included their Lululemon products. So that's another way that you can get Lululemon for cheaper. Second bra is the Free to Be Serene padded bra. It's this royal purple color. I really like it. Out of all the bras I have from Lululemon, this definitely provides the most support. So again, it is a free to be serene bra and I really, really like it. The next bra is the energy bra and it is high neck. I got this specifically for spin classes because I started spinning recently last semester at school because the spin studio opened here in Athens and I felt like I needed more high neck bras to kind of keep everything in because a lot of people just wear bras to spin and I didn't really feel comfortable wearing a low neck bra. So I got this high neck one and it really gets the job done. I really like it and it's super comfy and you'll see in a little bit, I have leggings in a matching color, so it's a cute little set. Next, I have the Free To Be Wild long line bra. So I have another Free To Be Wild bra, but this one is the long line. So instead of just ending here, they kind of added this extra fabric. And I was really, really excited about getting this bra. But honestly, I was super disappointed. As you can tell from the try on clips, it fits me perfectly fine. It looks super cute. But if you go to do any exercise at all, like literally even yoga, your boobs just kind of like fall out of it. And it's not because it doesn't fit me. Like it fits me perfectly fine. But I feel like it genuinely just has no support at all. So I still wear this just like day to day under t-shirts, like as I'm running errands, something like that. But you definitely can't work out in it. So keep that in mind. And the last in lemon bra I own, I'm actually wearing right now. So I'm just going to show the try on clip of it here but it is the free to be wild bra in the light gray color this is my very first lululemon bra i've had i think i've had it 
probably for like five years now and it still fits and it's really worn in so I feel like it fits me the best of any of the bras I have but again it doesn't really provide too much support so I use this if I'm doing more light exercises like I wouldn't really wear it to a spin class. Moving into tops, I have the Swiftly Racerback Tank in three different colors. So I have it in this lilac purple color, and the back is a racerback, hence the name Swiftly Tech Racerback. And then I also have it in this gray color. This is probably my favorite one. I wear it the most. The last color I have is this dark purple. I also didn't realize how many purple Lululemon products I have until I filmed this haul, so... That's pretty fun, I guess. This next tank top, I couldn't find on the Lululemon website, so I guess they don't sell it anymore. Um, so I'm really sorry about that, but maybe you can find it on Poshmark or something. But it's basically this little cropped um, tank top, and then the back is completely open like that. So I really like wearing this to spin class because it's really like light and airy and breezy, and I just think it is super, super cute. This next tank top I got a few years back and they definitely don't sell it anymore because I think it was like a limited edition collab item they made. But it's this tank top that says, this is yoga. This is yoga. And I literally just thought it was so cute. I have always loved yoga, but especially when I bought this tank top, I was in my like hot yoga obsession phase. So when I saw this tank top, I just had to buy it and I still wear it a ton. Um, it's a it's similar to the racerback tank in the way that it does have the back like that but it's a much like thicker material so I wouldn't wear this if it was super super hot outside but I would wear it to yoga or in the winter time I think it's great and the last two tank tops I can tell are the same style just based off the feel of them but again I couldn't find them on the website because they are older the first one is this speckled kind of tight pattern and then the back is mesh like this I really really like it it's really breathable especially for again like spin classes something where you're sweating a lot um going on walks outside with your dog who is currently passed out behind me um and the second tank top is the one I'm wearing now it's the same as the last one so I turn around for you guys you can see that there's also mesh on that but yeah <laughs> So that was all the tank tops that I own. Now we're going to be getting into the sweatshirt pullover type pieces, and I have two of those. So first I have my scuba hoodie, which I absolutely love. I don't wear it to work out or anything like that because it's literally like hoodie hoodie material, but I do wear it to class or just allow around my apartment or if I'm outside and want to be warm. Whenever you'd wear a normal hoodie, I wear this one, um, but I have this light gray color. And I think it's called the scuba hoodie because it zips up like literally to your mouth and then the hood comes over and you kind of look like a scuba diver. But I really like it. And it has this really cute patch on the hood. And this is just one of my favorite pieces I own from Lululemon, probably. The last hoodie item that I have, I got from Poshmark. So again, I'm really sorry, I don't know the name of it, but, oh wait, the tag's still on it. Yeah, it just says the size. It doesn't say what it is. But this is definitely one that you could work out in because it's like this insulated material. But honestly, it doesn't really fit me too well. Um, and I might be getting rid of it on Poshmark soon. So keep an eye out in my future videos for if I do a classic clean out or list anything on my Poshmark. And maybe you can get this jacket for me. So we finally are getting into the pants section of the video. So I have two pairs of shorts to show you guys one pair of joggers, and then a ton, ton, ton of leggings. So like I said before in this video, I wear leggings like almost every single day to class, to work, to the gym. Like I just feel like they're so versatile. And I know ooh, the leggings are super pricey. Like they can be upwards of $100. But to me, that's so worth it because if I'm wearing them literally every single day, I'd rather spend $100 on that than say spend $50 on a really nice pair of jeans that I wear once a month, if that makes sense. So in my mind, it just kind of evens out and I'd rather buy these leggings and have them last for years and years and years than buy a pair of like cheap $20 leggings from somewhere and then have to get rid of them after a few months or something. So I just feel like it evens out. <laughs> the two pairs of shorts I have, they're the Speed Up 4 in shorts and I have them in two different colors. So I have these black ones, which I absolutely love. They are so cute. They are super short, so you can't wear like a bigger t-shirt with them. And also I don't really like wearing them to class that much because your backpack kind of like pulls them up and then your butt is literally out because they're so short. But if I'm just out running errands or 
going for a run or going to the gym. I think they're really, really cute. And then I also have them in white. They're super wrinkly right now because I haven't worn them in a while. But I do like them because I have a lot of black tops. So I feel like it looks cute to have white bottoms with a black top. And the last item before we get into the leggings is a pair of joggers. So joggers are so out of my comfort zone and something that I would not typically purchase. But for physical therapy school, we're not allowed to wear leggings to class, which literally breaks my heart. But we are allowed to wear joggers. So... I feel like I'm going to be investing in a few more pairs of these, but these are the Ready to Rulu pant joggers. I will insert the try-on clip here, but I originally was planning on getting the Dance Studio joggers because those are the joggers that I've heard most about and have heard a ton of people showing on YouTube and such, but when I tried them on, they honestly just felt so cheap to me. Like, they felt like they were going to rip or break, and then I tried these ones on, and they were much thicker. They fit me much better, so... In my opinion, the Ready to Rulu pant is the way to go if you're looking at purchasing joggers. So now, getting into the leggings. <laughs> so the first pair of leggings I have in five different colors, and these are the Wonder Under pants. If you know anything about Lululemon, you've probably heard of these pants before. They are, like, everyone's favorite. They're honestly not my favorite, and I know you're probably laughing because I have so many pairs, but these were, like, the first Lululemon leggings that I tried out just because I'd heard about them so much, but... Since then, they've come out with a ton of new styles, which I'm going to show you when I get to my other leggings, but I honestly like the Aligns and the Fast and Freeze much more than the Wonder Unders, and I don't know if it's just because I haven't bought a new pair of Wonder Unders in a while, and these are pretty old, but they get kind of like crunchy feeling um, as you get older and less comfortable, so that's just something to keep in mind. So the first pair are these gray Wonder Unders, and they go mesh at the bottom and are scalloped. I think they're super cute and super unique. Um, they go well with a black top, which like I said, most of my leggings are black and most of my tops are black. So I wanted to get these just to switch it up and have just not all black athleisure wear. So I really like these. Next pair of under unders I actually got on either Poshmark or eBay. I can't remember, but they're these really popular herringbone ones and they're not cropped. They go all the way down. But they're super cute. Um, I don't really wear them to work out because they are so, so thick. Like, it's kind of like a sweater material. But they look really cute, honestly, just with, like, boots and a sweater in the wintertime. Just like a normal outfit. But you can tell. You can tell how big they are. And I think they're cute. Then I just have a plain black pair of cropped Wonder Unders that I like to wear working out. And then a plain black pair of long Wonder Unders. Another thing, Lululemon's leggings are super, super long. Like, I, I'm i five foot five, which I think is a pretty typical height, and the leggings are so, so bunchy at the bottom for me, the full-length ones. So I usually get the seven-eighth length, seven-eighth inch length leggings because those go all the way down for me and look kind of like full-length, even though they're supposed to be cropped. So keep that in mind. I would definitely try on leggings in store before you buy them. So I lied. I found another pair of Wonder Enders in my pile. These are black, and then again, they scallop at the bottom. They're the same as the light gray ones, but they're just black, and they're mesh on the side, and I just think these ones are super cute as well. So now we are done with the Wonder Unders. I'm going to show you guys the Align Leggings. If you've heard of the Align Leggings, um, you're not really supposed to work out in them. You're just supposed to kind of wear them around and do yoga in them. So that's what I do. These are the leggings that I wear to class, if I'm having a lazy day, if I'm just doing yoga, walking my dog, whatever, these are my go-tos. So I have them in a bunch of different colors. So I have navy blue, I have light purple, and this one I was talking about before that matches my bra, which I think is really cute. Black, obviously. Camouflage, oh my gosh, these are my newest ones and one of my favorites, honestly. These aren't cropped, the other ones I showed you were cropped, but these ones go all the way down. And then these ones are lines too, but the material feels a little bit different to me. Um, but these are one of my favorite pairs because they feel a little a little less like pilly. Like the other ones, if you don't wash them the correct way, which is on gentle separately, only with like fabrics, you have to do that. I've learned the hard way or else quality will deteriorate really quickly. But these ones I feel like I've had for so long and I haven't noticed any pilling at all. Whereas the other lines kind of, since they're so gentle and buttery, They've kind of deteriorated a little bit, but that's because I wear them so much. So that's not a thing on the lemon. That's me. That's my fault. So this pair, I have no idea what they're called because I got them on Poshmark, but they are so cute. They have this pink waistband 
and then they have pink down at the bottom too and they are so comfortable and they were I think like $50 or something really cheap on Poshmark so really cute and really, that's another thing about Poshmark not only is it cheap but people will be selling older Lululemon products that the stores don't sell anymore because I've noticed Lululemon used to have a ton of bright color fabrics and stuff and now they kind of only have black and white so if you're looking for some pink or some Lululemon color in your wardrobe Poshmark check out Poshmark the last pair of leggings is these fast and freeze they are black and then they have the little hydro reflecting things at the bottom and then drum roll please they have pockets this is why I love these leggings so much they have pockets and there are so many times when I've been like walking my dog or walking to class or whatever and I want to have my phone on me but not in my hand and pockets are just a lifesaver so I definitely want to get more pairs of fast and freeze even though I should probably stop buying leggings because I'm not allowed to wear them in grad school but I still work out a lot so I think I should wear leggings and I really like them <laughs> sorry sorry about that little rant Okay, guys, I think that's everything. My room is a complete mess right now. There's Lululemon all over my floor. I'm going to show you guys. This is literally insanity. This is like thousands of dollars worth of clothes right here. I'm ashamed. <laughs> I have a problem. As always, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you stayed till this point, shout out to you because I know this video is going to be super, super long. But I just really hope you guys have been enjoying my content recently. If you have any other video requests for me, please comment down below because I'm still trying to figure out kind of my niche and everything and what kind of videos I want to be making and what direction I want to be going with my channel. So that would really help me out. And if you are new, I post new videos every Monday and Thursday and I look forward to seeing you guys in my future videos. So thanks for watching again and go shop Lululemon.com or on Poshmark. Bye friends! My gloves, just do it, you like my hair, she thinks, just do it.